good morning to all uh, let's proceed further and uh, first of all save our file here as a uh, you know factor analysis uh, that helps us to know that yes i'm working on this particular file now click on code you can click as many times as you want and if you think that you have got extras you can just go ahead and you can delete it so i'm working basically on this one and i have got the text also with me wherein uh, if i want now for example i keep uh, the uh, notepad always ready so that uh, you know whatever uh, let's say uh, coding i have got i can go ahead and uh, copy paste from there or uh, do the correction for the editions now the best part uh, with the uh, i would say collab is that it allows you to do both the coding as well as work with the text also now for example this is the text that i have got so what will i do i will copy this means that i would be introducing each one of them one after the other and see as to how well we can go ahead and uh, use these libraries or the packages that are there basically for my own analysis so the first step uh that you can see is that we need to go ahead and install the factor analyzer so this is where i have got and i will click this is enter or uh, control enter you can do to run the program or you can use this button arrow button <clears throat> which is embedded uh, over here directly and you can carry forward and you will see that the moment you click if there is no error and this particular package is available it will go ahead and it will immediately uh, install it in your own collab which is present now that if we have taken care of now let us see uh, what else i have got so that i can um, understand as to what i'm supposed to do further now uh, pip install factor analyzer i have taken care now let's go ahead and import pandas as pd uh, from sk learn uh, this one okay data set so i think this is the one that i have got if i'm not wrong uh, so you see this is what happens and i prefer to uh, keep it as it is uh, here we go so import pandas as pd so this is what i have got here directly so i will go ahead copy the uh, code which is available for me out here which i have uh, saved it and if it is a uh, not uh functioning properly to with you you can just delete it so that it's not bothering you at all out here that's it and now you click on code so that i can proceed further with my next step of here and that is import pandas and now i don't have any problem with these things so i will go ahead and copy paste as it is and i will check out import pandas as pd um uh, let's see uh, there are pandas numpy is there then sklearn data sets import load iris uh, this is one of the data sets from factor analyzer import factor analyzer which we have here installed it however now i have to go ahead and import it import matplotlib dot uh, pyplot as for plt so that i'll be using it as plt however this will be used basically for the visualization so control enter to run this particular uh, code and to check out if there are any errors or not now you see if there uh, you know exist any error it will be highlighted in red color since it is not there so you can see now for example let's say i will just enter and here uh, check i'm just writing and now do control enter you will see it will identify immediately and now can you see name error Tra uh, trace back uh, most recent call last and here you will see it has highlighted and it says check is not defined so you see this is how the errors are identified and this entire arrow turns out to be red in color so now i have to remove it because i just uh, entered it so that uh, i can showcase to you each one of you so here we go so there is no error anymore so i have installed whatever uh, libraries and these things are required for me now i need to introduce my data set into collab 
so how am i supposed to do now for example if you are working on the uh, data sets which are available in the cloud server that's perfectly fine it will be able to read it in case not then i have to somehow use google's uh, collab to import the data set so i have um, i would say the uh, basic uh, formula i mean to say the code for it and i will be using it so here we go and i take it up over here that is uh, from google collab import files so i'm using google collab directly and i'm saying not only import files however i need to upload it so let's say for this particular uh, i would say factor analysis project of mine i would be working on a data set Um, you know which i had chosen uh, there are certain data sets which are available and since we are working on factor analysis i would be taking up the most easiest one and i click on choose files because no file is chosen so it would be asking me where do you want to go and um, uh, you know you want to uh, uh, understand i mean see where your files are there so here i have downloaded it it is bfi um here's the data set so i will just select it and click it so here you will see it will take some time again and the entire you can you see the percentage out here which is working and it will say that yes now the data set has been um i would say introduced or imported in the google collab also this is how you would be introducing the uh, importing the data sets into google collab next step now i want to understand and see what is it that now i need to read this particular file so how am i going to read the file that has been imported into the uh, google collab is what would be my next video presentation and along with with reading we would uh, see certain of uh, other steps so that we can know what kind of a data set bfi is all about uh, what uh, kind of variables are existing and we can even understand the nature of the variables also over there so keep watching for the next one so that we can proceed further with the factor analysis thanks a lot for visiting this particular playlist of mine thank you and take care bye